Why, big moment, of Israel invasion may not happen. The Israeli military and administration expressed a sense of impending ground invasion to revenge the slaughter of their people in the hours and days following the strikes on October 7. The much-promised ground invasion has not yet taken place, either because the decision-makers have paused for breath collectively or because of external pressure. Rather, in the last several nights, we've witnessed targeted and restricted raids, with Israeli forces leaving Gaza before dawn. It's a useful tactic that may continue for several more days. Israel is trying to keep Hamas off balance by shifting the point of entry and approaching from several directions, including the sea. Every time they enter the Gaza Strip, they demolish infrastructure, plot routes, examine the surrounding area, and get crucial intelligence. The IDF is advancing into Gaza little by bit. If there isn't a big moment of invasion, expect a slow and methodical stepping up of operations. Not only would Hamas have been caught off guard, but the more gradual build-up to a more extensive ground assault would have surprised everyone watching. As the Israeli Air Force flattens the land above, many fighters will be hidden below, subsisting mostly on frazzled nerves and nothing else, which will start to affect morale. Israeli soldiers will eventually have to go house by home and street by street. Then, there will be a much higher chance of ambush, booby traps, and snipers, but, these early assaults are intended to mitigate that risk as much as possible. 